What's up guys, Joseph Ruckett here from josephruckettsfitness.com and I want to show you one quick tip and technique that I like to use when training legs and when doing the leg extension that has really helped me really hit and target the quads a whole lot more. Now I'm going to show you the leg extension exercise. Now the normal way to do it is by sitting on the, the pad, having your back against the pad, pulling your body down, locking your body in, bracing your body into this machine. Then you want to use your quads, extend all the way up, squeeze and back down, squeeze and back down, which is really good and that is the correct way to perform this exercise. But again, I always talk about variety and mixing things up, trying different techniques, trying different angles because using different techniques and different angles is going to apply a different form of stress on the muscle which is going to rip the muscle fibers more than what you previously have which will result in more muscle growth. Now, I was watching um, some leg workouts on YouTube of Tom Platts. For those of you that don't know who Tom Platts is, I'll put a picture of him up on the screen right now. Probably the best legs um, to ever walk this earth. <laughs> and I was watching him do leg extensions, and he had a really weird um, and unique technique. So I copied it and I gave it a go, um, and it's been really hitting my legs so much more. So what that technique is, it is to lift your ass off the pad on every single rep. So I'll show you an example of what I mean. I'll go for 10 reps. So I don't brace my body in. Instead, what I do, I have my hands on my abs, use my quads, lift up, and then on the way down, I bring my ass off the pad like that. And then I extend from there. Notice my ass coming off the pad on every rep. So I've been doing that for the last um, few of my leg workouts and it's definitely been hitting my quads um, in a different form of stress than compared to doing it normal. Now, I always do it um, the normal way as well, and I always mix things up, but definitely if you have not given that technique a go, I learned it from one of the best in the world. <laughs> so give that a go and try it for yourself and see how it affects your quads. I definitely feel it a lot more in the upper thigh area, especially right up here. Anyway guys, I hope that tip was useful for you. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and check out the rest of my YouTube channel for so much great content like this. Anyway, my next set.